Hello everyone, it's me once again. Um, today I just want to show you, uh, I, I apologize for making another video, but I just want to share uh, with you my uh, experience in a public space. Normally I'm in the office working most of the time, but I, today I happened to, uh, I, I actually needed to go outside um, from our office to buy a external hard drive, either a two terabyte or four terabyte, whatever it was available. And I decided to go to the Apple shop because I tend to go to the Apple shop to see not only the thing that I normally look for, but originally what I look for, but see what other fancy stuffs are available. And once I walked in, I realized suddenly I was getting this strange feeling that a few Apple um, staff were looking at my, staring at my ear. And um, obviously I realized, damn it, I'm in a hornet's net here. These people are here, these staffs are here to try to sell their AirPods and I'm actually walking in trying to, um, you know, make them look really bad. That's, I kind of felt like, oh, I'm not really feeling welcome here. But as I was walking past by to the, um, the, the earphone headset section, very nice guy actually, um, the staff actually chat me up. He's saying that, oh, this, uh, yeah, but it settles very well. What product is it? And so I took it out and I showed it to him. I said, this is Bang & Olufsen um, E8. And he asked me whether the sound quality is good. I said, yeah, it's really good. Um, he also asked me about transparency um, mode. And I said, yeah, it, you can hear the music 25% and so on. And suddenly I realized I'm more act, I'm acting like a BNO E8 representative and he's the actually the customer here. But in the end, we had a very good chat. I told him that I uploaded a few videos um, about this on, on YouTube. Um, I don't know whether he's gonna check me out, but probably he might be in trouble if I say this. If I cause you any trouble, I apologize. Um, but um, basically, uh, we asked, he asked me how much it is. I said, well, it's 260 quid. He said, well, the response was, he said, well, it's not, it's not that expensive. Um, I might actually buy one. <laughs> so, yeah, basically he was convinced that, you know, about the design and the logo. We know, we all know that B&O is a very good brand. Um, and I asked how much an AirPod is. I was never interested about it, to be honest with you, but it, it was um, 100, 160 quid. So he knows the fact that you have to pay another 100 quid. So it's overall 260 quid to buy this. Yeah, but, and he was pretty much convinced, even the Apple shop staff uh, was convinced to buy this. And I felt very privileged at that, well, that moment. And I walked off, called my wife saying, hey, guess what happened in the Apple shop, uh, blah, blah, blah. And then as I walked, because I, I was initially looking for external hard drive for either two or four terabytes, I didn't find the one that I was looking for on Apple shop. I thought it was a bit overpriced. Uh, don't get me wrong, sometimes Apple Shop sells in a better price, but this time the actual product that I was looking for was not available and also it was the other one was too expensive. So I decided to walk into John Lewis shop and as I was still you know plugged on and listening to music, I could see that one young staff at John Lewis at Oxford Street, he was um waving his hand towards me and he he was like showing a sign going like this going oh you know is this the I think he knew what product it was um, but he said is there a noise cancellation for this I said no there isn't but when you once you put it in your ear it almost feels like you don't actually need a noise cancellation because you're it's pretty much a tight fit and he said oh have you actually wore it when you're on a plane and obviously I don't really travel that much nowadays uh, so I told him no but uh, he apparently says that um, John Lewis either haven't released this product yet and he said as soon as John Lewis actually released this product in the in the shop there he's gonna buy it as soon as possible so there you go so this is the privilege feeling you get for get you know wearing an e8 um, in the middle of Oxford Street or when you go to Apple shop uh, it's not available in Apple shop uh, in Regent Street at the moment. I have checked myself while I was looking for the product I was looking for. 
originally the external hard drive is not available at um, John Lewis either. At the moment, as what I understand, it is available at Harrods in UK and the Bang & Olufsen branch across the road from Harrods as well. It was released a week ago. Still, many people seem to be interested and heard about this product, but they haven't actually, they can't buy it yet. So I'm one of those privileged uh, people, should I say. But what I'm trying to get at is this. Maybe, just maybe, some of my f viewers on my uh, this product said that probably it's not one of the best sound that you're gonna get. I personally think, as I made a comparison to the other stuff that I had as a Bluetooth headset, and I think this is one of the best. I really do. Uh, maybe I am just deluded, maybe you might say, but the other thing about it is this, this is ex is this experience that I had, exactly this experience I had today. You feel privileged, people look on you, and um, they know that it is Bang & Olufsen, they want it. it you, you create this bit of a jealousy, but also you feel privileged to own a very beautiful piece of product that sounds excellent. Probably not the best, but excellent, should we say, because I'm, the, I'm not an expert for hearing, but I, I love the beat sound, it is fantastic. Um, and the sound is so crisp and clear um, but what I'm trying to say is that I mean seriously would you rather pay 160 pound for the air pod that the sticks why sticks sticks out than to floss look or rather pay, pay another 100 quid extra uh, 260 quid to buy this Bang & Olufsen um, I'm making this I'm stressing this point again and even the sh staff at Apple shop, they're impressed with it. Um, I'm sure quite few, good numbers of them. And also in John Lewis as well. So just go on, get this product, feel privileged. That's all I want to say. Uh, so, it, uh, so this is my, hopefully the final, final promotional video uh, of um, BNO, uh, BO Play. Bang & Olufsen E8, uh, the Bluetooth headset. Now I have dropped it once. It is quite a nice soft uh, premium plastic feel. It, it hasn't actually created any scratch yet, but um, some lovely lady was asking me a question. I had to have it see they just taken out and dropped it, but still there's no scratch here. But overall, um, buy it, feel privileged, feel, feel the the good feel of owning a premium brand for a decent price. Go get it now, as soon as you can. That's all I want to say. I'm really, really happy with this product. And I'm sure you will as well. And many of my viewers actually thank me for it. I mean, thank you for your kind comments. And um, they, they're loving it. So join the party of the Bang & Olufsen E8. So thank you very much for watching this video. This is Love Jesus, please. Bye-bye.